here's the home at Oak Grove Chase Drive. Just giving you a quick little scan. See this is a cute community as well. I'm just going to pause while I get up to the door here. Okay, so coming in, we've got, there's that little study room we were talking about. The stairs right next to the study. Living area. This is the dining room. This is the part Will didn't like, and I'm sure you don't like it. I don't like it either, but you see how they've put that little border in the wood. And again, this is a laminate floor. Here you've got your under the stair storage. <clears throat> and your living room. Got the kitchen. Breakfast nook back there. It's a pretty big space actually. And then behind me here, we've got our Big pantry. Laundry room over here. And then the garage. This is that garage that Will was saying, not a ton of space, which is true. It's just a basic two car. AC is original which we expect. It's 2003 home, so it's a, about a little bit more than half-life. So coming through this way, just to give you this view. Actually, let me give you a little bit of a better view of the kitchen. Coming over here. You see the other one side is fenced. <clears throat> other side isn't, and this is your screened in Lanai area. Coming over here. It's not better but it's flat. I mean you could play and run and enjoy yourself. Now I just uh, full bath here in the bottom part of the house. So like Will was just saying, there's one bedroom downstairs. As you can see, it's a view from out here. And what the back of the house looks like. Got a nice balcony up there. That's awesome. I love that. Let me just pause again. Okay, I'm at the top of the stairs now. This is this your view looking down? your view from the top of the stairs here. So this of course is your master bedroom. Over here we have the first bedroom. With a little walk-in closet. Over here the air handler. Not real interesting. Double check and the install date is the same as the one downstairs. Double doors into this master bedroom here. It's got tray ceiling. And the double sliding doors out to that balcony. It's one of your closets. I guess this is the linen closet. And here's the other closet. And then here's the master bathroom. Sinks on both sides. Here's your garden tub. And then the shower. If you're having a hard time seeing the dimensions here, it's a little easier. Separate commode area. 
I guess if you wanted to here, you could probably break the wall down between these two closets and make it one big closet. Something you'd have to look into. Over here is the common there bath. There is the next bedroom. And again, this one has a little walk-in too, which is nice because so often these rooms just don't have walk-in closets. Here we've got another little linen closet, just a tiny one. And then here is the last bedroom. Hopefully you're getting the gist of all this. I'm sorry I'm going a little bit faster. I just want to make sure I have enough space on this phone. So that's that on this particular home.